So all of us getting together to do vaccinations today. Text code. Which one? Oh, what number? No pain, no pain. It's like a little prick. <laughs> Are you guys practicing your CPR? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I am Paul and uh, I am from America. I have been living in Zhongshan, China for about five years now. And with everything going on the last couple of, of months and years really, I'm finally here at the Torch Development Zone International Exhibition Center to get my vaccine. This is my first vaccine. So I've been getting tested constantly over the last couple of months. And now I'm really excited to, to go and finally get, uh, start the process of getting a vaccine. So come along with us. And uh, we'll see you, just, we'll show you just how easy this process should be today. I'm really excited. All right, let's go. All right. Oh yeah, don't forget your mask. You need your mask. <laughs> Ooh, it is a hot day. Hot but beautiful day in Zhongshan. Yeah, very well organized, it looks like. People getting their temperature check, showing their health codes. All right. <laughs> hey, hi, how's it going? All right, good to see you guys. So all of us getting together to do vaccinations today. How long have you guys been in Zhongshan for? Five years. Five, me too, man, look at that. <laughs> How about you guys? I've seen you around. You look very familiar to me, you know? Hey, good luck to you guys. All right. Hey, good to see you guys. All right. You guys need to come to the Chinese class more often, you know? <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay, let's go get vaccinated. As you can see, there's a very orderly line. Not much of a queue today. So we're going to be able to get in here really, really fast. There's over 200 medical personnel inside uh, processing all this and they can do over 10,000 vaccinations in one day. Throughout the city of Zhongshan, there's over 30 free vaccination locations and they can do over 100,000 vaccinations in one day citywide. Let's go in and check this out. So it's a little loud out front, but it's okay. Here, the, the volunteers are gonna check my paperwork here. So you're gonna check my paperwork? Make sure it's all okay, yep, and then we go inside, it's great. Many, many volunteers. I think mostly volunteers. And the facility's huge, but more importantly, it's air conditioned. <laughs> okay. This is very exciting. I've been putting this off because I've been so busy at the term and I'm finally getting a chance to do this. And with the summer coming, it's the travel season. This is gonna make traveling not only much easier, but a lot safer. So now it looks like uh, we come to this group and we wait in a batch. We're gonna be waiting with a group of friends over here. Uh, it's a lot more comfortable in here than it is outside. It's really hot outside. We were waiting here to give some explanation on like, okay, if you have a high temperature or a high blood pressure or something like that, then you need to have your blood pressure checked. Uh, just safety things, you know, make sure, okay, if you're you know, a woman and you're pregnant, you can't get the vaccine right now. So that's all it is, it's just a little safety briefing. <laughs> so we're gonna sit down here and I have my original form here and we're gonna register um, for the vaccine. And what this does is it allows for the green code to come onto my phone, into the phone app. And it's uh, proof that I've been vaccinated and tested and all of that stuff. Okay, so it looks like uh, two forms. Uh, one is a health declaration. And uh, it's a general disclaimer. I have fully understood the type, uh, efficacy, and uh, all the other things, adverse reactions. Uh, and the notice is staying on the site for at least 30 minutes after being inoculated. So after we get the shot, we have to actually stay here for about 30 minutes for observation, just to make sure we're okay. All right, so I finished all the paperwork. I scanned the QR code, which I register online with my passport, my birthday, things like this. And then I paid through WeChat, 100 RMB. It's not very expensive at all. So now that that's done, I'm gonna go wait in line and uh, 
see the medical personnel here and register with the medical personnel. So it's my turn now. I'm going to register my information. There you are. It, it's a very similar process when you go get tested. Uh, you fill out some paperwork, some very cursory information, and then you come and sit with uh, a medical uh, professional who will then insert all the information into the computers. And all of this flows down into the QR code later on your phone. All right. Oh, shit, shit. Thank you. All right. Bye-bye. <laughs> All right, that's it. All the information's in the computer. And now we go to the next station where we wait in line to get the actual jab in the shoulder. <laughs> All right, so I got the vaccination certificate. It's in Chinese and in English. Okay, and I head over here. Which one? Okay. All right, so there are many booths that are open. You just pick one that's open. And uh, this lovely young lady here. So here she's gonna just check the information. She's gonna scan the QR code into the computer. And then I'm going to get the jab in my left shoulder. Okay. Mm. So the shoulder, alcohol. Are you scared? Nope, not scared at all, do it. Okay. 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 No pain, no pain. It's like a little prick, you know, that's about it. No big deal. Very, very uh, easy to do. Uh, uh huh. Uh huh. All right, now, now they're saying I have to wait for 30 minutes for observation, and that's it. Okay, she okay. said, thank you very much. Bye bye. Okay, and now we go over to the waiting station. Very, very easy, no problems. And here is the giant waiting center. So this is where we're all supposed to wait for 30 minutes. As you can see, there's plenty of seats. It's nice and air conditioned. Looks pretty comfortable. What are you? <laughs> are you guys practicing your CPR? <laughs> so how'd you guys do? How'd you, there's like no blood, nothing. It's pretty easy, right? Yeah, how do you feel? No problems? Yeah, 30 minutes. So, okay. Was anyone scared? You were scared? Really? You don't like needles? Okay. Ugh. All right, so I've been sitting here for 30 minutes. They came and brought me some herbal tea. Very, very nice. And I feel fine. So it's time for me to, to leave. So we'll get up and go. So here on the sheet, it has the time that I actually took the vaccination. And these nurses here are going to check the time before they let me out. Hey, how? Hey, how? All right, how? All right, how? Oh, shit, And then we're good. Bye-bye. So that's it. Back into the heat here in beautiful Zhongshan. It's a lovely Friday afternoon. Still got plenty of time before dinner. And now I'm going to go home and have a rest. Okay, so after 28 days, they recommend I come back to get the second shot. And they're going to send me a message into my phone uh, in order to do that. I think this is a very important thing for all foreigners to get done. Not only for your own safety, but also to show the locals that the foreign community is taking part in this endeavor. So come and get vaccinated. It's very easy, as you see.